Have you ever wondered how to create a staging website for your WordPress website? Well, in this video, I'm going to walk you through how simple it is to do this with Namecheap cPanel. There are several reasons, before we go on, several reasons that I want you to look at and consider as to why you need to create a staging website. Number one, secure your content. If you already have a website that's up and running and you want to update its look or just to upgrade it, change the theme. It is very much recommended that you create a staging website. I mean, even if it's something as simple as adding a new plugin, you might as well create a new staging website where you can test the plugin before making it go live because some plugins might slow down your website create issues in your website might not work well with other plugins that are currently running on your website so that's the main reason why you'd create a staging website number two you get to play with it as much as you want on the side while visitors are still visiting your current website and this is good. You, you want people to continue visiting your website so that the change, the change from your current website to your new look website is flawless. You can do it at a time you want, like at midnight, when you know you don't have as much visitors on your website based on your statistics. So creating a staging website is the key to your business growing and for you not to lose viewers or visitors because your website doesn't work well your website is buggy it's iffy and this is why I'm going to walk you through today how to create a staging website using Namecheap cPanel it's the easiest thing in the world the day I figured it out the, the day the feature was put in on the cPanel, I loved it instantly because we're also working on updating our website. So before wasting your time, let's dive right in. See you on the desktop. Cheers. Before we go far, when it comes to anything, servers, hosting, domain names, anything to do with our websites, our clients' websites, I always go for Namecheap. Namecheap is affordable, their servers are fast, and they do the work well. So I go for Namecheap. I would recommend you go for Namecheap. Therefore, I have added a link to Namecheap where you can click the link, go in, buy yourself a domain name, buy yourself a hosting package through Namecheap in the description below. So feel free to go there, click it. It's just an affiliate link. Nothing too shady about it. Uh, I'm recommending a service I use. So let's go right into it. When it comes to creating a staging website, the first thing you want to do is enter into your Namecheap account, head on to the dashboard, and then go to your cPanel from the dashboard. It may take a few seconds to load the cPanel because of your uh, internet speed. Bear, bear with them. Once cPanel is open, just rush down, all the way down to WordPress. Just check if you've got the Softaculous app installer and WordPress is there. If it is there, perfect. Enter WordPress. Before we go on, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to the channel, please. It helps motivate me. It helps me improve the content as I go. Please feel free to comment, ask questions if you have any in the comment section. I hope this is very useful to you. So having figured out that Softaculous is working, you've got your WordPress uh, app and you've opened it. 
let's go right down to current installations. Now, when you see current installations, as you can see, all of our websites are here. Let's just go in and uh, create a staging. This is the live installation. Now we have to choose an installation. Uh, let's go with resources. Sure. <clears throat> Resources.sncTmarketing.com. The system will fill in all the other details. Scroll down. Disable search engine visibility. <gasps> Put in a site name, staging, and create staging. It will take some time to process all of this, uh, about three to four minutes. Uh, don't turn off the page as the instructions say right here. Just give it some time and wait. The installation is complete. Now you can go over and check. Just right click, open link in new tab. There you go. And then when you open the dashboard of your staging website, you can see staging. It is up to date well not really you still have to update some apps however it is a version of your website so we can actually go and check it out visit site there you go so the staging website has been created and is ready for you to start utilizing. You can start making changes in the staging website without affecting your main website. And then when you're done with it, you can just shift all of this information on the staging website into your new web, into your original domain name. Okay, we'll do a video about that on a later date. But meanwhile, this is it. This is how we do it. Uh, I hope this has been useful. Give it a shot. Let me know how it goes. Uh, again, please feel free to like the video and subscribe to the channel. The more subscribers we have, the more people can actually view our content. The more likes we have, the more we are recommended to people who actually need this content. I hope it's been useful. Have a good day. Cheers.